Alright guys, welcome to a brand new Fantasy Draft franchise, 32 users. If you guys want to get in on these leaks, follow me on Instagram, and I post my story when it's opening. It's PS5 and Xbox Next Gen, but hoping for a good pick. I just did a Fantasy Draft the other day, bro, and literally got the number one pick. So hopefully our, our luck is still there. We're going to see. I chose the Patriots. They have pretty cool uniforms. I like, I, dude, hot take. I think the red throwback Patriots jerseys, top, top three jerseys in the league. Top three jerseys, and it's not three, so... All right, guys, let's hop in the draft. Hopefully, we get a good pick. Leave a like, comment, and sub if you like this kind of content. Let's go. All right, man. Let's start the draft. Pick one. 22, dog. Come on, man. 22. All right, it's all good. I guess I guess it could be worse. I feel like having one towards the end is better toward, than towards the middle, but still a terrible pick, in my opinion. We'll see you guys pick 22. All right, guys, we are up here, and the right pick here is Trevor Lawrence, dude. Like, I drafted him last league. In this in in my ps5 league and i hate drafting players again but i'm already at disadvantage because i don't buy abilities bro so like i can't afford to not pick a qb with gunslinger because i'm not gonna get one if i don't draft him you know what i'm saying so unfortunately but fortunately trevor lawrence is there so we're gonna take him oh god all right t law let's do this thing again let's run this thing back baby let's run this thing back all right we'll see you guys next week all right guys we are up i think i'm gonna take trayvon Diggs here had a uh, rough, rough go about it in the, in in real life, but um, he's a really good he's a really good corner. He gets abilities, and the way I've been playing lately, I've been playing a lot of zone, um, and he's a really really good zone coverage guy. And man, not bad, you know, good at both. He's gonna get abilities. He's already an 89 overall. Maybe we can get him a breakout to X Factor um, to get in that other ability slot. But corners are very scarce and very valuable in this league because you can you can't move um, people like you can't move safeties to corner. And you can't move corners to safety. And there's not a lot of superstar corners. So, um, I like that pick a lot. We'll see you guys next pick. <clears throat> Alright, guys. We're about to up again. The thing is, I do want to take um, two superstar safeties here. But I also want to take, like, a receiver or something. Um, so, I'm a little bit of a cro at a crossroads. Do I take a receiver? Or do I go, like, running back here? You know what I mean? I could take Josh Jacobs, who's a stud. Um, but I also feel like there will be running backs available later. It's just tough because these KOs help my defense so much, man. Like, they help my defense tremendously. I just gotta see if it's worth taking, you know what I'm saying? And we're up. Oh, Micah Hyde, 6 feet, 90 overall, 88 speed. And we got Jordan Poyer as well. I'll probably go Micah with this pick. And then do I go defense or offense? We're going to pick in a second again. I don't know, man. All right, guys, we're up. Um, okay, so this is another dude I keep drafting. But, dude, it's just such a good pick. He's a superstar depth. He's the only superstar receiver left, so you know that's great value. He's hidden. I feel like not a lot of people know that he's hidden superstar. So I'm sorry, not sorry for drafting him again, dude. JSN, he's just he's just a stud. He's a stud. We'll see you guys next week. All right, guys, we are just about up here, and I think that I'm going to take Aaron Jones here, 90 overall. Really, really, really good receiving back. Um, and if you guys know me, man, I love throwing on running back, but he could also carry the ball. Like, he has good, literally good everything. Um, so I'm really, really happy getting him where I got him. With my pick after this, I think I might take I have my eye on Jordan Davis. So you're probably like, why are you taking Jordan Davis? Well, one, he's the only superstar. Hopefully he's there and I look like an idiot. All right, he is there. He's the only superstar to tackle. And for some reason, I think because he has 96 strength and he's just huge. He's 6'6", 336. He sheds like crazy. He stops the run like crazy. But he also gets to the quarterback, bro. He's 80 speed at 6'6", 336. So hopefully he's there. All right, guys, we're up. Hopefully he's still there. I haven't checked. He is. Jordan Davis, welcome to the squad. Let's go. All right, guys, we are up. Um, Khalil Mack is still here. And I'm pretty sure he still gets edge threat. So I'm going to draft him. I'm going to draft him. Khalil Mack, welcome to the squad, baby. Welcome to the squad. All right, guys, we're about to be up here. Um, I literally have no idea who to take. Literally no sweet clue who to take here. Maybe... Maybe another corner? I don't know. But I want to take, like, a young, like, 
Could take someone like Drake London, but he's not that fast. I already got a slot receiver. Um, I'll just, I guess just take a user. Oh, my God. Terrible, terrible, terrible. I had no idea who to pick there. Oh, God. All right, we'll see you guys next week. All right, guys, we're about to be up. I think I'm going to draft. So I wanted our boy Brent's. If you guys follow the channel, you know I draft him all the time, but he just got taken, unfortunately. Um, so I think we're going to take our other safety here. Last pick, I... Worst pick of my CFM career, bro. Like, does just forget about me picking Tyson Anderson in, like, the seventh round. But hopefully we can make up for it here if picking Grant Delpit. Um, I love my tall safeties, bro. I love tall DBs, especially because I play a lot of zones. So Grant Delpit is a really good pick because he's only 24. He's a star dev, could potentially get a breakout game to superstar. Um, so if he's there, we'll definitely take him. All right. Del Pitt, welcome to the squad. And we got to take one more guy. I had my eye on, um, I know we do need receivers, but I feel like all the, like, I'll show you guys the receivers right now. We need a fast receiver, but all these dudes are going to be here for a while. You know what I'm saying? Like, I can get any one of these guys at any point in the draft. So I'm going to save that for later. Um, Josh Sweat is really intriguing. If he's there, I'll probably take him. Um, if he is there next round, we'll have... Him, Khalil Mack, and Jordan Davis. So that's a really good D-line. So hopefully he's there. We'll see. All right, guys. Rob, actually, I'm going to take Dawson Knox. I didn't realize he was here. He's 26 years old, 87 speed. Um, really, really good tight end this late in the draft. And he's got a potential to go up to superstar. He's only 26. So hopefully he can spark a breakout game with him. Breakout game with him. Um, we will see. We will see. I like that pick. Because our D-line's already good, bro. Our D-line's already as good as it can get. That would have been a kind of a dumb pick, I feel like. So... I like that pick a lot. We'll see. We got, uh, what, three more picks? We'll see you guys then. All right, guys. We are about to be up here. And who do I take, bro? I think I'm going to take... um, Because I play zone, like I said a million times. Trey Flowers is here. He is six foot three, 74 zone coverage, 91 speed, which is pretty freaking good. Um, all right, we're up. Um, so I can either take Trey Flowers... Or I could take, um, it was Booth Stardev? He's not. He was last year. Um, not Booth. Who was the other guy? Oh, uh, Paulson and Debo. He's Stardev. So, I feel like this is a better pick. I'm going to pick Paulson. And then I'll, I'll pick. Probably take a receiver with my next pick. We'll see. We'll see who's there. All right, guys. We're actually going to take Trey Flowers here. That should round out our DBs. Um, 6'3", 91 speed. Like I said, 93 excel. Really, really good Madden corner, especially for how I play. I might play him in a slot. I'm not sure. Um, we will see, though. We will see. All right. We got – actually, we got one pick left. One pick left. Definitely going to take a receiver, a fast receiver. We'll see who's there. All right, guys. We're up. Just going to take a fast receiver here. Uh, I'm going to go with friend of the channel, Paris Campbell, man. I interviewed him on my channel. If you guys did not see it, go check it out. But he looks freaking sick. Number zero. Fast receiver. Um, 26 years old. Star dev. Could probably get a regular game for him. But that's going to run out our draft, man. We're going to see you guys week one um, before the first game. I'll show you what our team filled out as. Our, our depth chart and all that stuff. So we'll see you guys then. All right, guys. Week one is here. Um, I'll show you guys. I already did my depth chart and everything, so I'll show you guys my lineup. Uh, we actually have a squad. I'm not going to lie. We have a squad. Okay, so our offense, Trevor Lawrence, Aaron Jones. We got Paris Campbell. Andy Isabella, the CPU draft for us, a 94 speed. He's a good third receiver. JSN in the slot. Um, O-line, not terrible. You know, nothing crazy, but not terrible. We didn't draft any, so this is all CPU um, work here. Um, do I leave? I'll leave Cleveland there. Dawson Knox at tight end. Then defensively, Jordan Davis, Cleo Mack. We got Adafe Owe, who's a really, really, he's like 90 speed. Um, really good speed rusher. Paulson Adebo, Trayvon Diggs. Tyson Anderson is going to be our user. Then we got Micah Hyde, who's playing actual safety. Grant Delpit. Cameron Dantzler is a star dev. He's super young. I'm going to play him throughout the regular season to see if we can get a superstar breakout. If not, we'll put Trey Flowers in for the... Uh, for the playoffs because Trey Flowers is old. He's not really going to progress anyways. So we're going to see where that takes us. 
So that's our squad, bro. That's our squad. We're going to hop into week one versus the Eagles. Looks like we have a camp standout. This actually could be a Dafaeli right here. If I had to guess. I think it is. Yep. Why am I, why am I a genius? All right. So he can get a breakout this week if he gets two sacks or two tackle for losses. Then it goes to next week with these camp standouts. And if he gets it next week as well, he gets superstar. So... It's tough, though. It's really tough. I've never gotten one of these before. I'm going to go passing game here. Um, I've never gotten... I've never, like, completed a camp standout breakout. Because it's, it's pretty much you have to do it two weeks in a row. It just makes it really hard, especially with a D lineman. All right. Defend medium pass. We're playing the Eagles. Week one. Start our training. All right. Aaron Jones has an upgrade. I'm going to go receiving back because I want to get running back apprentice on him. At some point, um, I have Energizer Jukebox. I don't know. I'm going to go short out elite on him because I'm probably going to pass him a lot. Grant Delpit with an upgrade. I'm going to go zone. He gets plus two zone coverage. Adafe Owe with an upgrade. Um, I guess I'll go Power Rusher. Acceleration. JSN with an upgrade here. I'm just going to go slot. Like I said, he's hidden superstar, man. He's hidden superstar. So once we get the, the, the snap count done, he will be a superstar. Paulson and Debo with an upgrade. Going to go zone on him. Hopefully either Paulson or um, Cameron Dantzler gets a, gets a breakout game. But we'll auto-upgrade the rest of these dudes. And we'll hop in the game. Start off with a run. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, Aaron. Let's go. Could very well be uh, cover one. And it is Paris. Paris, good freaking catch, baby. He's got a safety on him. Yep, let's go, Aaron. Let's go, Aaron. That's what I'm talking about, man. Switching here, I think, to cover one. We should have JSN. Hmm. We might have. I didn't want to risk it, though. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Aaron. Oh, yeah, Aaron. JSN, good route, baby. Good route. Hmm. I didn't think that was man. Let's go, Trevor. Great. Oh, my God. Way to make a play, man. He was stuck on his D-line. I knew Trevor was fast enough to outrun him. What a play. Thank you. Okay. Thought I would get up for that. Good tackle. I'm scared this is going to be a QB run. But it's Derek freaking Carr, man. Like, Yep. Jordan Davis. What are you doing? He just ran right by him. Oh, my gosh. I have inside stuff. And to make it even worse, I have Reach Elite. I have Reach Elite. That is just sad. Oh, my God. I should have lobbed it. Oh, my bad. There it is. Adafi Owe, too. He's got that break, I remember. He's got that break. I think I might count as a tackle and a ta uh, tackle for loss and a sack, but we'll see. It's raining, man. Will he miss his field goal? He hit it. All right, let's let's buckle down on offense, man. No more stupid picks. Yeah. Who is on Paris over there? I wonder if he could burn him. Trevor. 
Trevor, dog. Okay. There we go. Take it for six. Take it for six, Aaron. This has got to be man, right? Good route bounce, Paris. We had Paris on the streak, but he, he usered it. We might have him this time. I think we do. Good freaking pass. Let's go, Paris. There we go. Adafe? Let's go, baby. That's the break. That's the... Let's go. He has a touchdown. Let's go. Holy crap. I didn't put my dude in a freaking deep half. But it's Derek Carr, so he couldn't make that throw in the rain. In the rain, that's tough. Jukebox. Ah. Go Dawson. I'm gonna run that again. We should have Paris. He's got no one on the. What is that defense? We, we do have Paris. Let's go. Let's go, Paris. Come on, baby. Tyson. Tyson. Let's go, baby. That's a big time throw, Trevor. Score, score, score. Let's go. Way to hang in the pocket, man. Adafe. Adafe. Whoa. I think he just clicked a random button, man. I'm not even going to lie. Bro, what the hell? What, what just happened? Damn, bro, that's annoying. What the hell? Thank you. What's the flag, sir? What's the flag? Holding. He must have was blocking on aggressive. I thought that was on me. All right, Paris. Oh, shoot, bro. Maybe I should have lobbed it. I don't know. That's on me. Bro, this dude definitely has his blocking on aggressive. That's, that's, that's... <laughs> I just got two points. <laughs> this dude, hundred percent, has his blocking on aggressive. I that those are the first two holding calls I've seen in Madden twenty four. That's hilarious. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude, I wasn't paying attention. Good return. Daniel Bellinger? Daniel Bellinger. Bro, what is my guy doing, man? What? I'm sorry. This is a strange game, fellas. Like, we've had two safeties. We returned an onside kick for a touchdown. Like, what is going on? 
There we go. Let's go, Dolan. Let's go, Aaron. Woo! Woo! JSN? That's an insane pick. Good for him. Good for him. I'm throwing way too many picks, dog. Oh, my God. If we get another safety here, that's got to be an NFL record, right? Pick. Oh my God, Del Pitt. Carl, try it again on second down. Another holding call. Is down in the this is insane. This is insane. <laughs> Khalil Mack. They'll go for it. It's Carr. Good D. <clears throat> Good D. Again on second and ten. Round him up, JSN. Round him up, baby. Let's go. In order to get home or to their final destination. Yeah, I don't think there's a whole lot of room to make around, especially if they can't score here. They do go for it. It's Carr. Wow, what a hit. GG's, man. GG's. All right, we should have got this camp standout as well. Uh, let's go. The rise continues. That's sick. Adafi, 20,000 XP. Key to victory. Entire team earned 1,000 XP plus five staff points. All right, guys. Dominant week one win. See you guys week two versus the Dolphins. All right, guys. Welcome to week two. Um, coming off a dominant week one win. We're playing the Miami Dolphins, and we can continue our breakout, our camp standout. So we need three sacks or TFLs with Adafi Owe. Going to be tough, but I hope we can do it. We got like three. I think we got four last time. This dude has – who was that? Was that Jalen Hurts? I didn't even see his quarterback. Um, start our training real quick. Adafi has two upgrades. Okay. I'm just going to go power rusher just to get his overall up. If we can, power rush, power rusher. I'm surprised he doesn't have speed rusher, um, to be honest. Alex Singleton, Joshua Williams. All right. I'll upgrade these guys. Let's hop in the game, man. She says you got a new whip. Uh. Adafi, give me a TFL. Shoot. All right. If he doesn't block his tight end here, we're going to scream. Or we should. There we go. Is it Owe? Oh, Thompson, we need Owe to get that sack. Ski and Delhi running dirty. Okay, Paris, make a play, bro. Make a play, bro. Yeet. Oh. I said, girl, why do you keep calling? Oh, JSN. She said you needed a whip. Uh. Okay, it's locking. She said you need a new whip. Uh. I said, girl, why do you keep calling? When you're hot as ski, you let me pull up. Ski. The big time route, JSN. That's a big time route. Really? He literally hit stick my guy through. What? He hit stick me through my own player. Yeah, and just right in between us. Okay. <sighs> All right, am I going to get my head out of my freaking... 
Come here. Can we let Uche get free though, Khalil? Like, can we just let him, my boy? Can we let my boy just get a sack, please? I said, girl, why you keep calling? Yep. Dancer, stay, stay, up. yes, stay on your feet, stay on your feet. Oh. I said, girl, why you keep calling? Thank you. Tackle. I said, girl, why you keep calling? I said, girl, why you keep calling? It's because Trevor Lawrence is on the phone. <laughs> oh, God. I need to get outside more, fellas. She says you need a new whip. Uh. Bro, am I the worst player? All right, I'm, I'm dumb. I'm not locked in at all, man. Thank you. <laughs> oh, right. I mean... I'm on my phone. This isn't fair. I said, girl, why you keep calling? Yo. Okay, bro. That was the most incredible throw I've ever seen in this Madden. the hell is that? Is that Trayvon Diggs? Is Trayvon Diggs even on the field? He's on the other side. Who is that? Paulson Adebo. What are you freaking... I'm genuinely concerned on what you were looking at right there. Thank you. Oh... Good knockout. All right, let's lock in, bro. I I am not locked in at all on offense. I gotta just play my game. Get out of there. Get out of there, Andy. All right, it's gonna stop before half. But this let's let's put some pressure on him. Bro, where Paulson Adebo must have like negative zone coverage. I have him on a 20 yard flat. What are we doing, fellas? Come here. Clear Max, stop stealing all the sacks, dude. Tackles. Hey, you can tackle, Paulson. I'll take that. All right, let's shut here, fellas. Let's shut here, fellas. Get off. Get on offense, dude. Good hit. Let's go. Let's go, Aaron. Make him miss, bro. Make him miss, Aaron. Don't I have jukebox on you? And they'll try and throw forward with Lawrence. Eluding the pressure right. Got it. What? Bro, how is Jared Goff making these throws? Thank you. 
Thank you. Good juke. Let's go. It's a KO. That's a KO. Pick. There we go, Trayvon. There we go, Trayvon. All right, let's get seven here. Do I not have jukebox on him? I could have sworn I did. He's not laying up though. Uh, stupid high balls. Oh, yo, I don't have a timeout. Oh my god. I thought I had a timeout. Holy crap. Go, Aaron. We'll keep feeding you, Aaron. We'll keep feeding you. All right, now he's gonna leave Paris. No way he gets that right. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Almost lurked him. Yep, good play, Khalil. Pick. Dantzler, that's his second pick, bro. That's his second pick. Okay, let's play offense for real. I'm going to stop messing around for real this time. He said I need a new win. Uh. Make a play, Aaron. Uh. What do I have on him, bro? I do have jukebox. Why, why is this... Jukes, not boxing, bro. I said, girl, why you keep calling? She said, oh, I might have had Andy. There's a, there's this jukebox light up. All right, can we get a passing touchdown? Three picks, no touchdowns is horrendous. I'm actually embarrassed by that. Get juked, bro. Get absolutely shook. Let's go. Come here. Josh? Oh, Josh was coming in there. Okay. I can't imagine that in their huddle that they're thinking at all about getting a field goal. They want to get him well to not show that he's having a problem. You know, they always tell you no matter what there we go. you keep throwing the football. Bro, Paulson, if you don't start making plays, I'm trade I'm literally putting Trey Flowers in. Like I don't know what you think this is. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Okay, I mean, it's kind of like making a play, Paulson. We'll take it. Tackle, nice. Yep, good D. Picked off by Micah Hyde. 
Good D. Let's go, Micah. She says I need a new whip. Uh. Let's pretend that never happened. Thanks. Honestly, it's okay, though, because I need to be on defense to get Josh UJ some sacks. Which, uh... Or, bro, is this a dot for AOA? I always get that messed up. Holy crap. Until I'm on. 24 minutes until I'm on. Oh, what a throw. Good for you. Damn, I passed him into there. Throw. Thank you. Oh, he highballed it. <clears throat> he highballed it. Good for him. Good pass. Good freaking hit, Grant. Good hit. I put the zone over there to cover that, and I didn't think he would get there, but he did. That's my boy right there. Clearly that was four and a half sacks, man. Like, I'm not mad, but I wish it was Josh. I don't know how to get Josh in. I switched sides. Literally everything. Yep. What a freaking play by Khalil Mack, dude. Looking like a great pick right now. It's Khalil Max literally making plays all over the field. Nope. He keeps trying to highball everything. Yep, good deep. Oh, we, can, we can pick that, though. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to pick that. All right, he's taking three. First down ends it. This is way closer in the game than if I just like had half a brain on offense, it wouldn't be close. And then where we are. The left side to Jones. Yep. I should have stopped actually. Made it second and short, but too late for that now, man. If I just like run around in the backfield, I think I'm good, right? Yeah, just kneel it. GG's, man. GG's. Let's take a delay. We'll take a delay here. And uh, if we just take a delay, punt it off, we'll be good. Punt it out of bounds, we're fine. GG. GG, man. Let's go. All right, T-Law has an upgrade here. I'm going to go... I'm going to go field general, actually. Because I want to get him to Hot Rod Master as soon as possible. He gets a plus one throw power. Let's freaking go, man. Oh, he gets an ability slot as well. Uh, let's go inside Deadeye. We'll take that. Lonnie Johnson, who we play at linebacker, I believe. All right. I mean, I'm going to be honest, man. I played terrible. I played absolutely terrible. But the thing is, we got the win. Camp standout. I don't think we got this, unfortunately. Um, Yeah. I don't know, man. For some reason, last game, he was coming free every time. This game, Khalil Mack was coming free every time. So... I guess it is what it is. Like I said, those are really hard to get. We got the divisional opponent, Jets, next week. Last first gonna be poetic. I feel, I feel like you cannot handle all the truth. I feel like you.